Good morning, everybody. Monday. Oh, I can I could not get out this morning. Oh, it's quarter to seven. Graham's still in bed, but him. he's actually having a lane, which is very rare, which is nice. Oh, the breakfast of the moment is the uh, fruit and fiber. Fruit and fiber? Yeah, I think that's what it's called. Yeah, it's just like brown flakes with like dried fruit. You can see like the bananas, it's got raisins, and then I'll put blueberries, and then just some of my coconut almond milk, although the hazelnut milk's really nice with this. And tea. And tea, oh, of course. <laughs> Did you sleep well? Yeah. I'm okay about six. Not too bad. Could have been worse. <laughs> <laughs> One child is eaten, and I've done his pet lunch. But Violet is still asleep, and it's quarter past seven, so I need to really get her up. Bye, Lou Hans. Bye. He's kind of under that hair somewhere. <laughs> Is that a good album, is it? That's what Alistair got for his birthday, didn't you? From your friend, that CD. Music in the background. Oh, God. We're going through this teenage stage at the moment where he just keeps putting his music on. It's driving me insane. <laughs> I think it doesn't help being in a bungalow where we're all on the same level. So, every, like, someone's noise is everyone's noise sort of thing. You can't kind of shut the door and get away from it. Um, I'm, yeah, I'm actually, Graham's taking the children to school today because I have got a little kind of like audition for a spinning, um, to be a in, in, spinning instru instructor at my gym um, as a little extra. So there's a few of us that are having this little half an hour spin session uh, to see if they want to put us through to um, do the course because obviously you've got to pay for the course. So yeah, that's what I'm doing this morning. I've got to be there for 8.20 and obviously the kids start school later. So Graham's going to drop them off. I actually picked up this ombre top, like gym top from um, New Look yesterday. They do actually have the leggings to match, but I didn't want the leggings. But yeah, this top, it's only 12, 12.99. But I thought it was quite nice. Usually I go for quite just bla black, you know? But I thought that was quite nice. A mop done, shall we? Right, where's your actual, um, oh, it's there. No, I've probably got a new badge. This one, I'm going to have to put that on your rainbows. Is it worth it today? No, not till Friday. Okay, I finished my spin audition thingy. It was probably about 20 minutes. It wasn't that much. But, um, yeah, we'll see how that goes. There's loads of people there, so, I don't know. Because I'm new, I have, do you know what I mean? Just don't feel like you have high hopes because I'm quite new and not that, I'm newly qualified, so... Um, anyway, I did an extra hour in the gym, um, because I haven't been since Friday, and yeah, it's about 10 to 10 now, so I've literally just come to Lidl, I don't know if you can see it, I'm in the car park now, so I'm going to do a quick food shop, and then head on home. Pooped on my car, oh, so annoying, All right, I need to get my bags out, <sighs> just noticed some flowers, <gasps> peonies, oh my god, I've got to get these. Right, food shop is done. Right, food shop done. The only thing that irritates me about Lidl, they stick a brand new big Lidl in and they don't put enough staff in. So like, you have to queue ages behind lots of people with huge trolleys and you just think, I don't know if this bloody sit someone else on the film. Anyway. Oh. <sighs> Spent 62 pounds. So, not as bad as last week. I'm just going to quickly pop to Waitrose just to get my nut milks because they don't actually do them. I think they do only soy milk in um, Lidl. Don't really like soy milk. And yeah, so I'm going to get those. Hopefully they're still on offer like last week. How could I not get a free coffee? Yeah. And can you see what else I got? They're still on offer in Waitrose, those ice creams. Just filmed my grocery haul and always the worst bit is putting it all away. And I'm starving, like I'm so hungry. It's like 10 past 11, but I seriously need to get this food in the fridge. The fridge isn't actually looking too bad. Uh, we still got those pasta things from last week. This is gonna be a quick dinner for when I'm working. Um, we've got a couple of steaks left. I'm doing pizza tonight, so I'm going to actually make pizza dough in a minute. I'm actually gonna have lunch first, obviously, because I'm ravenous, I'm hangry. Half past 11, I'm gonna sit down and have some lunch. And oh, this house is such a mess. Like, 
I don't know. I don't know if it's just my, well, this is an excuse. <laughs> you know, starting work and doing evenings. When I come home, I'm just so tired and so like, just can't be bothered. And obviously Graham's looking after children and working himself. I just, yeah, I just, I'm finding it really hard just to keep on top of the house. And during the days, I've just wanted to like chill out and just see people and get other stuff done. And I don't know, but I really need to pick up, make beds, um, put stuff away. I've got ironing to do. I need to hoover so badly. So I finished my lunch. I was watching a little bit of Team Mum OG. I love it. Oh, it's just so good. I've been watching it for so long. You know, you just feel like you have to sort of follow it. Anyway, yeah, just halfway through that, but I'm going to actually start tackling the house. I'm going to do like a little tidy up thing, you know, like those 10 minute tidy ups, but I'm just not going to put a timer on it and just show you, show you the chaos. Look, yeah, Lego. Um, what, I've got ironing. I'm just going to put that away for now and I might do that this evening because Graham and the kids have got karate, so I'll probably do that then. I've got towels to put away. Um, the kitchen's actually fine because obviously I use it so much. But Alistair's room needs doing. I haven't made his bed and it is just chaotic. Kids' toys and stuff just drives me insane. Violet's room is exactly the same. Tackle the lounge first, of course, because this is driving me insane. Transfer. I'm going to transfer some of his stuff that he's made actually to his room because he's got he's made quite a good bit down here, which looks pretty cool. rugs up and stuff so then at least I can hoover I'm just gonna get my big hoover out now and just go around the whole house fluff the cushions up and yeah it looks a lot better a lot more tidier Lego is in its right place which is good okay I've just had a full-on cleaning session um, I've had the back doors open and just shaking off the rugs and I've had I've been hoovering basically the whole house and I've cleaned, cleaned the bathroom floors as well. I already did this floor yesterday, not yesterday, Saturday. Yeah, but funnily enough, my Amazon package, because I was um, I was outside just faffing around with the garden furniture because, um, sorry, you can't even see me, because obviously last week the weather was so rubbish, um, We, no, I didn't actually pack things away. I was a bit, I was kind of a bit in denial that it was really bad weather and I left a lot of the furniture cushions and stuff out but I kind of hid them underneath the tables but yeah everything is pretty much blown around all over the place so I was sorting stuff out and then I realised that I had an Amazon package like hiding behind my barbecue and I was like I don't know how long that's been there I ordered the package I ordered the stuff last week so um, yeah it's only been there for a couple of days so it should be fine so I can't remember what I ordered so maybe we'll do a little bit of an unboxing and um, I actually got Alistair's sort of glow-in-the-dark science kit out. Um, he actually, this is what one set that he got for his birthday from um, his friend. And I've been such, I was such a moody mummy last week. I was just so miserable. And every time he got it out, he got it out like half six, seven o'clock in the morning a few times. And I was like, seriously? And then a couple of nights I was working. 
So I've been basically putting off the mess because obviously these science kits are a little bit messy. So I'm going to make it my mission to help him do it tonight. It actually looks a really cool set. So um, yeah, I'm trying to <laughs> make it back up to me because I felt so bad last week. That was such a moody thing. Oh yeah, I've got a couple of... Ooh. Okay, so I bought some BCAs or BCAA. This is basically this pineapple flavour. This is basically a pre-workout, so you can take this before you work out. Um, and it has glutamine in, in it, which is really good for women. But obviously men can have it as well. It's got loads of, it basically just gives you a really good boost of energy without, it's basically caffeine free though. It's got B6 in it, um, BCAA, um, yeah. And I wanted to give it a go. I've been meaning to try it for ages because I've never taken pre-workout before. Just add a scoop to water and instead of just taking water to your workout, you take this with you instead. So I got the pineapple flavour. And yeah, I'm going to give that a go. I also got some peanut butter. This is quite a high protein peanut butter. Um, it's by Protein Works. I've tried a couple of their brand things from the brand before. And it's literally just 100% peanuts, so it's like nothing extra, nothing added. Um, and yeah, it's quite high in protein, and I've nearly run out of my pippin nut. Um, I wanted, I'm excited to see what the consistency is like. Um, I wonder if it's traditional, like because my pippin nut is really quite runny. Um, yeah, so this was only this big tub. I think it was five pound ninety nine with free delivery. Which is a really good value because it's a one kilo. It's absolutely huge. Also got, I think that's it. I also got the Protein Works Diet Protein Truffles. Um, high in protein, low in sugar. Basically just a, just a little protein snack. I thought it's something to try. I've been having those bounce balls, but I, I think I've got maybe one left, uh, or maybe two left. So I thought I would try something different. Um, yeah, these are low, low salt, low sugar. So per, how much, is it 30 grams? Yeah, 30, 15 times 30 grams of truffles. So there's only 2.6 grams of sugar per truffle. Um, and it's higher protein. It's got 10.2 grams of protein. I need to get my protein up because I am so bad at eating protein. My diet is actually quite high sugar, um, would you believe? But it's just from general foods and quite high carbs so i'm trying to like even it out balance it out so i'm gonna try those and actually see if if graham likes them because he is back how's mowing going mowing don't forget your glasses what? next time i've got you from cocktail for lunch mm -hmm. oh, cocktail. i need to get in the shower clearly because i'm a mess for your lunch you too i am gonna sort myself out because i just done my pizza day. I have had a shower, I just haven't washed my hair. I just I need to sort this out. Um, yeah, I've done my pizza day, so that should be fine for dinner tonight. I've just got some washing out. So I'm gonna fold that and it's half past one. I also put my flowers, my roses from last week still look really good, so I'm leaving those in here. Um, I'm gonna finish watching Team Mum, um, but it's only half past one, so I might make up a tea at some point and finish watching Team Mum, fold some washing. I do need to do some editing as well and sort out this. <laughs> okay, I am heading off to school. <laughs> it's quarter to three. I'm kind of like, I'm gonna be rushing. Up to children? Mm-hmm. Yeah? yeah? He's a bit excited to be out, bless him. <laughs> boing, boing, straight, heading straight for my child and Kale's his favorite, but to be honest, it's so overgrown, look at it. I usually just break off leaves to just put in his pen. And then I've got my lettuce that has grown that I can start picking. And then these are my runners. I put runners around it because that's just where um, I didn't actually get any more lettuce. And then also I've got more runner beans here. And this one is the, I think it's cucumber. More, more runner beans here, which I don't know what to do with. I might give them to mother-in-law. And then I've got tomatoes here, which still needs to go in this one, but Graham needs to take out all the weeds. And then we've got weeds and carrots in there, as well as broccoli here, which, look at that. So cool, it's flowering, so it's gonna get these dogs and just up here. Quick, and lamb. <laughs> the 
kids are actually have got the chicks and fed out, so they're just playing with them. This we've got some calves in the field with the sheep because we turned out the sheep the other day. They were all sheared, and they all had their lambs. Um, but there's one. Um, where is it? One calf. They're quite big calves, obviously, because they're not with their mums anymore. Um, but one has literally got a troll's hairdo. Not the cutest thing ever. It's got a proper tufty. I call him Branch. All the sheep. A lot of them had um, black lambs. You can kind of see their little heads. Um, the grass is really long. Can you see? Somewhere over there. It's Graham on the mower. It takes hours to cut. Hours just back and forth. Hey ben, <laughs> look how big they're getting. Look how big they are. They're out in this pen now because they've got kind of got the feathers. Careful. Mm -hmm. Look at you, Viley. Are you a little cat? Yeah. And she's got heel high heels on. <laughs> Which one have you got? Cheap, cheap. Mom, excuse yeah. me, Aww. little guys. Excuse me. We're making a um, a glow magic bouncy bouncing okay, ball. Okay, so join the ball mold together. So we do a little bit of this, then glow powder. A little bit of this, and glow powder. Yeah. Ready? Don't worry if it goes everywhere. We'll just sweep it back up. A bit more. That's it. Yeah. That's it. That's it. Oh. Is there a hole in here? Can we do another one one day? I think we should probably do the pink one as well. Oh. Oh, wow. Pop. What about crystal growing? It grows. Yeah. Not all of it, just three quarters of it. Is that enough? The water's green. Oh. Just all over. Sprinkle, that's it. Yeah. And it should make some crystals in about 72 hours, apparently. It's like fluffy snow. <laughs> it's like jelly. Is that it? I think that's it. Oh, I feel it. it does feel like snow. Doesn't it? Just feel it. That's just bouncy ball. Woo! Well, hey, make your own bouncy ball. Right, we're going to do pizzas now. Pizzas. I'm going to sit up, bye. Cut me out. Creations. Look how good they look. Spanish. While it's been test tasting everything, of course. But we are literally just about to have dinner, actually. Uh, I just finished off corn. The kids' pizzas are out, which look amazing. Look how good they look. And mine and Graham's, I'm just put ours on the top shelf. Um, yeah, and Graham's just got home. It's five. Got some serious zits going on at the moment. Look at that pizza. Let's been doing puzzles. Frozen puzzles. You got those for your birthday last year, didn't you? Do you remember? Sit up, your pizza's ready. Look how good it looks. <gasps> now I'm clean up done. It's 20 to 6. Graham and the kids are going karate. Um, going to karate, so you're getting ready. Well done. I'm actually going to tackle my ironing pile, which is pretty naff, I know. Tackle it. You know, tackle it down. Which isn't, isn't that big, to be perfectly honest, but I just want to get it done because it's school stuff. She was shown. What's that then? Saying, hey! No? Hey! She Oh, I'm going to do it. I love mushrooms. I love mushrooms. I love mushrooms. I love mushrooms. Oh, God. Um, 
yeah, I'm just cracking on mining. Graham and the kids have just gone I'm watching the chase and it's six o'clock. So I am going to finish off this ironing, do a bit of editing and just chill for a bit and then they'll be back. So I will catch you all tomorrow because I'm not doing anything exciting now. It's going to get boring chores done.